Hello everyone, this is Riku Keyblade Master, and I regret to inform you that, um, apparently I received news of another cop that was killed. This time he was a 52 year old, uh, but this time he wasn't killed by a rioter or mistakenly killed by another cop. It was a suicide commission. And I, I feel really bad for the family that he has, if he has any family that he left behind. If he, um, if anyone notices anyone with suicidal thoughts or actions, and, um, and or has suicidal thoughts or actions themselves, I urge you to find a suicide hotline in your area and call it, pretty please. As I said, this world has lost too many innocent people and we don't need to lose any more. I, I don't think that we need to lose anymore. I, I feel like we need to we need to keep people around for as long as we can. And I I just when I found out I just I just shook. I was like, oh my God. You know I just I just feel terrible that there's nothing that uh, could have prevented what he did. Um, the other cop that died, the uh, uh, the first cop that died, it was determined that he was hit in the head with a blunt object, and that blunt object was a fire extinguisher. But the other cop is who I'm focusing on right now. I just... I can't believe it. Another soul taken by suicide. I just... Oh my god. Ugh. I can't even express any any other words right now. I just wow. Um I like I said I received some footage of the protest, but I didn't know who was who that did what. So I couldn't tell you most of you already know who the two cops that died, and most of you probably already know the one that committed suicide mainly. Um, I, I like I said, I I express my condolences, my deepest condolences. I I just. Wow. Oh my god. I just feel so bad that, you know, we couldn't... That neither of us could be there to prevent it. I'm, I feel like, because I'm the guardian of life and death, pretty much, while well, one of them, I feel like I failed in my job. As a guardian, I... Oh my god. I know what some of you guys are thinking. Don't beat yourself up. You didn't fail. You couldn't have known it was gonna show up. But still, I... I don't know. 
how to feel right now in terms of these two deaths of these police officers, mainly the one that committed suicide. And I'm going to say it again. If anyone knows anyone who has had thoughts of suicide or tried suicide commission, um, or if you yourself have tried, please contact the suicide prevention hotline in your area. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, I have been Riku Keyblade Master. Comment, rate, subscribe to become a Keyblade wielder. And stay awesome as usual. I'm sorry that I'm not my usual chipper self. It's just that this was hard for me to do. I I just feel like a failure when someone takes their life by suicide. I feel like I failed in my job. I feel like I I swear to God, I feel like the whole world is resting on my shoulders. I'm not kidding. And I, that's why I try so hard not to make mistakes. That's why I can't stand failure. That's why, because when I was a little kid, I was always told that I was going to amount to nothing. That I was always going to fail at every aspect, at every turn. And because of that, I also had considered suicide about three times. As I told you guys a million times before, and, but I never acted on it. I just thought about it. I never, like it was never something that was on my agenda. But witnessing more and more people you know, going through that destructive choice, I mean, I can understand if someone takes their own life due to, like, nobody being there to help them, and nobody really cares enough to help them. I at least get that. And, like I said, I lost, um, when I told you guys that my friend Erin got married, she may have lost her husband, Scott, but, um, I lost a friend a few days after the reception, and I just... I, I just, I'm sorry, this is really hard for me to do, like I said before, but just gaining the courage to do it, for me at least is a win. So thank you guys so much for watching, Till next time I've been Riku Keyblade Master. Comment, rate, subscribe to become a Keyblade wielder, and stay awesome as usual. I love you guys. And like I said, if anyone notices anyone thinking about committing suicide or having done any actions, please, please, please urge them to contact the suicide helpline. And if they don't, contact it for them. Pretty please. I am urging this as a major plea.